Hey guys, this is Anthony Morganti from AnthonyMorganti.com. This is episode 33 of Lightroom Quick Tips. In this episode, I'm going to show you how you could auto adjust one of the two sliders in the white balance section of the basic panel of Lightroom. Now, let me explain. As you can see, we're in the basic panel here and we have white balance. Now, you could manually move these sliders around, or you could use the eyedropper and try to get a white balance, or what a lot of folks do is they could just go to this drop down and they go to auto. And you could see it's going to adjust the temperature at 5600 and the tint at 2700. Well, there might be an occasion where you might want to adjust one of them and not the other. And an easy way to do that is let's put it back as shots, so we're back to our original settings is just hold the shift key in and double click on the name. So we want to auto adjust temp. Hold the shift key in and double click on temp and it will get it to that 5600 in this case for this image. But we're leaving the tint alone. So this way you could adjust one and not the other and this might give you a little more um, create, creative freedom I guess with the image. So I adjusted the temp to the textbook setting that Lightroom thinks it should be. And then I could maybe manually come in here and adjust tint myself uh, just to manually adjust the image. Now, this trick of holding the shift key in and clicking on the name will also work in the tone section. So if you want to automatically adjust, let's say, uh, exposure, you could hold the shift key in and click on ex double click on exposure and it will automatically adjust that. That plus 1.55 is the exact same number you'd get if you double or if you just clicked on auto here. If you click on auto, it automatically adjusts all these sliders. And as you can see, I don't really like that. So we're going to go back to where I where I adjusted it. Uh, kind of like it that way. But again, you could hold that shift key in and adjust just one of these. And those of you that watch my videos know that I have taught how to adjust the white and the black sliders in that manner. But it will also work with the shadow, the highlights, contrast, and exposure, and as I mentioned, tint and temperature. It does not work with any of the present sliders. It only works with all the sliders above the present section. But that uh, hopefully will help you out. Uh, you could auto adjust one slider and leave the other ones to be manually adjusted or leave them where they were to begin with. Uh, hopefully it'll help uh, save you some time and maybe save some guesswork. If you really don't know where shadows should go, just hold the shift key in and double click on shadows, and that's where Lightroom thinks shadows should go. So you could run with it if you so choose. So that's it for episode 33. I hope that helps you out. I'd like to thank everyone that watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon.